show with Bini Bini Santa Ignacia. This ensemble is an inspiration from the costume of the dwarves that can be found in the northern part of Santa Ignacia. It is made up with different types of fabric to create a beautiful tribal garment that represents the beautiful diverse community of the municipality. The head of the tribe is an engraved with so-called patupa, a rice cake wrapped in corn banana leaves and a proud delicacy found in Santa Ignacia. This represents the tight and close cooperation of people of Santa Ignacia towards one sweet goal. A creative piece of headdress has been added with full of hanging materials to give highlights to women leadership as it is the anchor of the ensemble. This represents our beloved Mayor Nora Madomo being one of the few women mayor leaders in the province of Tarla. Diverse community, different colorful stories, one common goal, one Santa Ignacia, designer Avi Pogliere. The boy boy in Macadamia, named after the first female municipal mayor, Mayora Elma El Macadamia of San Clemente. Inspired by the Ifugao tribe that taught the people of San Clemente to black boy boy. Integrate weaving patterns in vibrant earth tones, symbol of unity with nature. The ensemble includes a hand woven skirt and baha for authenticity. Adornments like beads, bells, feathers, and brass accessories to incorporate and reflect the tribe's rich cultural heritage while intricate embroidery and tribal modest highlights the significance of Blanding Boy Boy in San Clemente, which is the main product of the municipality. Designer on in Montalvo and Jazz Yalum Rodriguez. was inspired by the ethnic group called Abelian Tribe. This unique piece of creation reflects the rich and abundant production of crops from the fertile land of the Aitas. Knowing Aitas are good in agriculture and farming, 
This costume itself is a showcase of their cultural and traditional attire. Abedin Aitas are well known in wearing red pieces of cloth wrapped around their body. Red represents their uniqueness, characteristics, bravery, and their own simplicity. This piece is not just made as it is. This is made to expose and to preserve the vanishing culture of the ethnic tribes. This cultural piece adorned and made with wooden beads, recycled rubbers, old pieces of fabrics, rattan woods, bamboo hats, and other native materials from the municipality of San Jose. Designer, Mark Paul Sabado. This ethnic modern costume is a tribute to the first inhabitants of Turlock, the Aita tribe. The intricate patterns adorning the attire draw inspiration from the traditional fabric of the Aita people, reflecting the rich heritage of their Lubai and copies. The headpiece is crafted from the resilient cotton tree and adorned with kapas kapas flowers in the Aita dialect. It serves as a symbolic homage to the municipality of Tabas, echoing the roots of its name. As a passionate advocate for Aita empowerment, feathers and lights interwoven into the ensemble represent the aspiration to uplift and illuminate their path towards progress, recognizing their invaluable contributions to the rich history and culture of Tarla. Designer! Inspired by the ethnic tribal heritage of Anao, features intricate patterns and vibrant colors. The attire incorporates traditional weaving techniques, showcasing motifs from indigenous tribes like the Aita and Ibanag. Early tones symbolize harmony with nature, while the rich yellows and greens mirror the colors of the Elam Elam flower. A prominent product of Adao. The costume includes beadwork and embroidery, highlighting the town's craftsmanship, and accessories like handwoven belts and headpieces that pay homage to the community's cultural identity. Designer Giovanni Dance.
This patriotic costume pays homage to the Bastarla as the inaugural seat for the revolutionary government in the Tarlac province during the Spanish regime. The vibrant colors of yellow, blue, and red represent the spirit of patriotism. The incorporation of rhinestones and crystals symbolizes the historical significance of Chico River, while the overall design is a tribute to Nuestra Señora de la Paz, or Our Lady of Peace and Good Voyage, adding a touch of cultural and religious celebration to the ensemble. Arriba la Paz, a tapestry of unity, prosperity, and development by Jomar Peralta. First batch of PDPDs in their national costume show. but a symbol of hard work and bravery. The costume is a representation of the Ida community of La Fnei by a Dr. La. The costume portrays the remarkable aspects of the Ida in terms of their profound connection as to both plants and animals that have a great impact and effect to their lives. The costume is made of a hand-woven Igorot fabric accentuated with hand-woven beads that represent the native culture and traditionally added a taste of a hand props of an intricately made handicraft, a visual of an animal bone and a chicken feather. The Sire Erja de la Serna. Conception. Just as Conception's history is steeped in resilience and triumph, Queen Fendelua ruled her rule with grace and strength, elevating it to a parallel beauty and prosperity as the golden threads of her robe shimmered in the sunlight. Queen Fenbenua's presence illuminated the kingdom, much like the Diamond River, casting light upon the currents of myth and legend that flow through its land. In her legacy, we find echoes of Concepcion's own journey, a beacon of divinity and prosperity, guiding generations forward in celebrating the rich tapestry of Concepcion's history, we honor not only the triumphs of our ancestors, but also the timeless wisdoms of legends like Queen Benvenua, whose stories continue to inspire and uplift us today. The Sider Axel Queen.
Billy Billy Ramos. This ethnic costume representing the culture of Ramos Tarlac encapsulates the essence of Dayal, celebrating community's heritage with a blend of tradition. Colors inspired by symbols, including hand-weaven patterns, symbolizing fertility and prosperity. The headdress embellished with feathers, beads, and embroidery serves as a symbol of unity and ancestral reverence. The designer, Jake Arnikizon.
Trix and Katako pays tribute to a leader of the Maguindanawan tribe, Sultan Kudara. Inspired by his legacy, it is a vibrant canvas depicting the Maguindanawan cultural heritage. The details serve as a visual narrative of their rich traditions past the De La Cruz. Stop! 
awesome. Not only serves as a visual spectacle, but also stands as a testament to the rich heritage and traditions of the Maranao people. Designers Enrico Sachosa and Jean Aaron Mercado of Stylized by Denmark. Thank you. 